Take control with the 50-30-20 rule. This budgeting method is designed to simplify your financial life and help you allocate your income effectively. By dividing your income into three categories, you can ensure that your needs are met, your wants are satisfied, and your savings grow. Are you tired of living paycheck to paycheck? Do you find yourself constantly worrying about how to make ends meet? It's a common struggle, but it doesn't have to be your reality. Do you feel like your finances control you? The stress of mounting bills and the uncertainty of unexpected expenses can be overwhelming. It's easy to feel trapped in a cycle of debt and financial anxiety. You're not alone. Millions of people struggle to manage their money. Financial stress affects people from all walks of life, but there is hope. Understanding and implementing effective budgeting strategies can make a significant difference. It's easy to feel overwhelmed by bills, debt, and unexpected expenses. These financial pressures can take a toll on your mental and emotional well-being, but remember, there are tools and resources available to help you regain control, but there is a way out. By adopting the 50-30-20 rule, you can create a balanced budget that allows you to manage your money more effectively. This method provides a clear framework for allocating your income, making it easier to stay on track and achieve your financial goals. You can take control of your finances and achieve your financial goals. The 50-30-20 rule is not just about budgeting. It's about creating a sustainable financial plan that supports your long-term success. By following this rule, you can reduce financial stress and build a more secure future. The 50-30-20 budget rule is a simple yet powerful tool that can help you do just that. Here's how it works. Allocate 50% of your income to needs, 30% to wants, and 20% to savings and debt repayment. This structure ensures that your essential expenses are covered, you have room for discretionary spending, and you're consistently working towards financial stability. This easy-to-follow method can put you on the path to financial freedom. By consistently applying the 50-30-20 rule, you can develop healthier financial habits, reduce debt, and increase your savings. It's a practical approach that empowers you to take charge of your financial future and achieve the peace of mind you deserve. The 50-30-20 rule is a simple budgeting framework that divides your after-tax income into three categories. 50% goes towards your needs. 30% goes towards your wants. The final 20% goes towards your savings and debt repayment. This allocation ensures you cover your essential expenses while still having room for enjoyment and financial security. The beauty of the 50-30-20 rule lies in its simplicity. It's easy to understand and implement. This makes it an ideal budgeting method for beginners. It provides a clear framework to track spending, identify areas for improvement, and make informed financial decisions. No more complicated spreadsheets or confusing financial jargon, just a straightforward approach to get your finances in order. Real people, real budgets. Applying the 50-30-20 rule. Let's look at how different individuals can apply the 50-30-20 rule to their lives. This rule is a simple yet effective way to manage your finances by dividing your after-tax income into three categories, needs, wants, and savings or debt repayment. By doing so, you can ensure that you are living within your means while also setting aside money for future goals and unexpected expenses. Take Sarah, a recent graduate earning $3,000 per month. Sarah is just starting her career and wants to make sure she is managing her money wisely. She decides to use the 50-30-20 rule to create a budget that will help her stay on track. Using the rule, she would allocate $1,500 to needs like rent, groceries, and utilities. These are essential expenses that she cannot avoid and must be paid every month. By setting aside this amount, Sarah ensures that she has enough money to cover her basic living expenses. Next, she would allocate $900 to wants such as dining out, entertainment, and hobbies. These are non-essential expenses that bring joy and relaxation to her life. By budgeting for these items, Sarah can enjoy her free time without feeling guilty about overspending. Finally, she would allocate $600 to savings and debt repayment. This category is crucial for building a secure financial future. Sarah can use this money to pay off her student loans, build an emergency fund, or save for long-term goals like buying a house or starting a business. Now consider John, a married father of two with a monthly income of $6,000. John has more financial responsibilities and a higher income, so his budget will look different from Sarah's. However, the 50-30-20 rule can still be applied to help him manage his money effectively. Applying the rule, John would allocate $3,000 to needs, like the mortgage, groceries, and childcare. 
These are essential expenses that are necessary for his family's well-being. By setting aside this amount, John ensures that his family's basic needs are met. He would then allocate $1,800 to wants, such as family vacations and dining out. These expenses allow John and his family to enjoy quality time together and create lasting memories. By budgeting for these items, John can provide his family with enjoyable experiences without compromising their financial stability. Finally, John would allocate $1,200 to savings and debt repayment. This category is essential for securing his family's financial future. John can use this money to pay off any outstanding debts, build an emergency fund, or save for long-term goals like his children's education or retirement. As you can see, the 50-30-20 rule provides a flexible framework that can be adapted to various income levels and lifestyles. Whether you are a recent graduate just starting out or a parent with a growing family, this rule can help you create a balanced budget that meets your needs, allows for some fun, and ensures you are saving for the future. By following the 50-30-20 rule, you can take control of your finances and work towards achieving your financial goals. Budgeting blunders, common mistakes, and how to avoid them. In this section, we will delve into some of the most frequent errors people make when trying to manage their finances and how you can steer clear of these pitfalls. Even with the best intentions, people often make budgeting mistakes. These errors can derail your financial plans and make it difficult to achieve your goals. One common mistake is failing to track expenses accurately. Many people underestimate how much they spend on small, everyday items, which can add up over time. Without a clear picture of your spending habits, it's impossible to create a realistic budget. Keeping track of every expense, no matter how minor, is crucial. Use tools like budgeting apps or spreadsheets to help you stay organized. Another pitfall is setting unrealistic savings goals. While it's great to be ambitious, setting goals that are too high can lead to frustration and disappointment. Start with a small, achievable amount and gradually increase it over time. This approach not only builds your savings but also boosts your confidence as you see your progress. Lastly, many people fall into the trap of impulse purchases. These unplanned buys can quickly blow your budget and leave you with buyer's remorse. Before buying something, ask yourself if it aligns with your budget and financial goals. Consider waiting 24 hours before making a purchase to see if you still feel it's necessary. This pause can help you make more mindful spending decisions. By being aware of these common mistakes and taking steps to avoid them, you can create a more effective and sustainable budget. Remember, budgeting is a skill that takes time to develop, so be patient with yourself and stay committed to your financial journey. Supercharge your savings. Bonus tips for the 50-30-20 budget. Want to take your savings to the next level? Try these bonus tips. First, automate your savings. Set up automatic transfers from your checking account to your savings account each month. Second, look for areas to trim your wants category. Even small reductions can add up over time. Third, consider increasing your income through side hustles or freelance work. Allocate any extra income towards your savings goals. Ready, set, budget. Take control of your money today. The 50-30-20 budget rule is a powerful tool for achieving financial freedom. It's simple, effective, and adaptable to different individuals. Don't let your finances control you any longer. Take charge of your money today. Start by tracking your expenses, setting realistic goals, and sticking to your budget. With discipline and commitment, you can achieve your financial dreams and live a more secure and fulfilling life.